There's gotta be a lake around here. It's not the boats. There is. Honey. destination from there. Didn't think we were going to hike today, but it's kind of hard not to when you're at a place this beautiful. Is there an entire mountain range that we've never heard of this beautiful? We spent the weekend in Bishop, California, having never been there before, and realizing just how beautiful this part of California is, we kind of wanted to explore a little bit more. The whole reason we're here is I just researched pretty places, and this is kind of something that popped up. Oh my gosh, what kind of bird is that? Either way, there was really no reason we had to come here, just besides trying to see it and realizing it's far more beautiful than even the pictures online depicted. So, I hope you enjoy it vicariously through us. Looking like there's a lake just like this five and six miles away. We're not gonna make it today. Can't believe this still. Which way? We're not catching dinner tonight. Hiker trail that way. That's how I read that. So the John Muir Trail? So will we just agree that we should go this way? I think so. All the lake. Look how thick the bark is. Like four or five inches. Right on to you, right? Wow. Holy moly! This is all snow melt coming off the mountain, feeding the lake. I really hope my camera can capture it accurately, but this water is like the most beautiful blue. Not quite a royal blue. I don't know, it's just perfect. Amber's fascinated by the color of the water. I'm fascinated by the color of the rocks. They match your flannel. So they're really pretty. It doesn't get much better than this. Nope. It's quiet, clean, and free. Cause I'm very busy. That's wild. Just across the street from Convict Lake is Hot Creek Geological Site. There are no signs on the main road for this location. Turn right after the airport and then you'll see a sign to follow it here. A little itty bitty wooden sign.
I can smell the sulfur. Oh, cool. I wish I could get in there. Yeah, this has to be the only one because it's the only area that's fenced in. Always uphill. Although it's only one pool, the only other place in the entire country that I know of where you can see something like this is Yellowstone National Park. What makes this better than Yellowstone is there's so many less people, it's surrounded by these beautiful snow-capped mountains, and it's free. You can also camp for free pretty much right next to it. This whole area is national forest, and you see other RVers and campers, so this would be a great place to post up for a few nights. But this is not where we're gonna camp tonight. We've got one more hour drive. All right, I gotta know. If you've got a view similar to this, even remotely close, are you the happiest person in the world or what? How could you not be? I'm, I'm genuinely curious. If you have that view around you at all times, how could you not be happy? I had told Nathan on the way here that uh, I think people can swim naked here. Pretty sure, I mean, whatever. It's like still mid-afternoon and we've seen more than one naked person. Some people are very carefree. More, more than one age. Also. Yeah. And uh, it was funny, the one naked person actually ended up, I think, kicking out the other naked person because they felt uncomfortable. Saw a whole lot of something I wasn't expecting to see, to be honest. Half smoke. Oh, oh, oh. That prime spot is being occupied at the moment. I'd rather not go over there. Too warm. Oh, hot. Ooh, that is muddy. I'm not sure I'm cut out for hot springs. Hop on in, the water's warm. How is it? It's pretty warm. Pretty good. Is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's one more down there that we've seen that you can get in. There's a whole bunch of them. I've heard, yeah. yeah I just need to figure out how far do we need to go to find them. Okay, so the main parking is just right there. Yep. Right. And then um, there's two, I think, right at the top. And then the walk down, it's it's not far at all. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. And keep heading that way. they're bigger. Yep. And they're less muddy. Oh. Let's get going. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> but the only thing is, is those sometimes, for some reason, are a little bit cooler. Oh. 
Sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. Cool. Enjoy, you guys. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for the info. Do you want to walk down further, Nathan? And see him? Yeah. Just or worth do you a shot. Want to just hang out here. Much cooler. I'm not really sure how we first got here and these three perfect pools were completely full, including the old naked man. And we just walked back over and now we have it all to ourselves. I think we scared everyone, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> this is just mind boggling. We were just at a thermal pool that you couldn't get anywhere near because it was so hot. Several people had died in the past 50 years. Don't go near it, it's scalding. This one, comes out at the perfect temperature right out of the rock. And they got these convenient little pools. Well, that happened to be our first time in a natural hot spring for both of us. We were having a, such a good time, but a little known fact about me, I kind of really hate hot water. <laughs> the girl who found hot springs, I really want to go to hot spring. Can't sit in a hot tub for longer than 10 minutes. Not even five minutes, five minutes, 10 minutes max for sure. I get hot too fast, like sweaty, uncomfortable, just Little can't body can't take it yeah i can't do it i don't even take really hot showers um but besides the point we we're having such a good time that we're gonna run into town and grab some stuff and then come back and set up camp what did we get so they had your noodle soup but instead they also had bouillon chicken bouillon so we can make broth whenever we want so i got a can of mixed vegetables we can put whatever else we want in there I'll make soup and I got a beer. Not a very good beer, but I wanted to be like, sweep the legs, Johnny, and we got a Coors Banquet. I'm not gonna use any of that. It's okay. Right. One of my favorite things is just first stepping out of the car and checking out the view. And it's a pretty good one. Hot springs are right over there. Cozy. That's how it goes every night. <laughs>